Hey, everyone. Hey, I'm Shannon. Welcome to Friday Faves from our new location in downtown Ocean Springs. I'm so glad to have you all here today. We're going to be talking about our local school bows. And then in the coming weeks, we're going to talk about our very popular uniform plaid bows and our new school designs that will be coming out in the next couple of weeks. But because school starts so early here, I wanted to make sure to bring our local bows on first so y'all could see them. But uh, before we get started, I want to tell you a little story about a little customer we had um, yesterday. She was the sweetest little customer. And like I said, we're um, fairly new to Ocean Springs. We've been here, I think, about two, two or three weeks now, something like that. And... Um, so I like to ask everybody that comes in, hey, where are you from? Are you local? Are you visiting? And we get a lot of visitors this time of year. And uh, yesterday she was visiting. She was shopping with her dad. It was actually after closing time. They said, are you sure we can come in? I'm like, yeah, sure. I'm the owner. I love sales um, because I need to pay the rent here. <laughs> And anyways, they were super friendly. They took their time looking around. I asked where they were from, and they were from Texas. Uh, and finally, the little girl picked out one of our little 4th of July bows and um, one of our unicorn bows, which are uh, two really popular bows here. And she told me that she picked it out to wear for her grandma's 70th birthday on the 4th of July. And um, they come and visit her from Texas every year on the 4th of July. So I just thought it was the sweetest thing. And she was just uh, the, the cutest little girl. And I just love that they make trips every year to see their grandma for her birthday. So uh, what are y'all doing? Hey, just say hey. Um, welcome here. Let me know in the comments where you are. Uh, if you got any plans for the 4th of July, anything like that going on. Um, or you can tell me where you're from if you want. We're going to be doing local school bows today. So uh, just let me know. Uh, hey, Jillian, did that work? I'm testing my little thing out. Glad you're here. <laughs> um, just let me know if y'all have any, um, any fun plans for this weekend, if you want. Hey, Kaylin, how are you doing? You're local, glad you're here. Oh, Jillian says they're headed out for the fireworks show. I'm trying. I'm trying to read this. It's all so small. This little thing. Oh, there it is. <laughs> We're headed out to the uh, fort for the fireworks show. Yeah, that's cool. Let me see if I can figure. It. <laughs> and Kayla says she's got no plans. Her daughter's in a pageant. Oh, that's fun. Well, good luck with that. That's um, that's really neat. We're just, we have some um, family here for, that actually moved here recently from Alaska and some family from Northern Alabama. So we're going to get to see them all. So it's going to be kind of a fun little thing. So um, kind of excited. My kids are excited about that for sure. So. Oh, so it says, looks like uh, she says, Chloe's here too. Hey, Chloe. Y'all are making me nervous. You've got your kids on here too. That's good though, because I always, that's one of the things I always do when I'm here. I'm always asking the kids, what do they like? What do they want? It's really important to know. So we're going to be talking about our local school bows today because um, school starts here really early. We start like at the beginning of August. And so I wanted to roll those ones out first, kind of get your feedback, see if there's any schools I needed to add it, anything I needed to change before we get deep into this um, season. Also, I have a special announcement at the very end. If you are interested in purchasing any uh, school bows, you'll want to stay to hear that. But we're not going to be on here long, so I won't keep you too long. Anyways, let me show you and you all can get a sneak peek real quick right here. Let me see if I can get it to work on camera. This is our local school board right now. These are all our large size bows. Can y'all see the local schools on there? Um, we have a quite a few, uh, since we moved from Pasadena, we have quite a few of the schools from over, um, you know, all the way over from, you know, Pascagoula, Gautier, East Central. So we're slowly adding, we're going on to get in the Iberville. Oh, y'all, thanks. <laughs> thanks. Appreciate that. So we're adding some um, of the new schools. Those are all, uh, so if you, there was one on there that you didn't see, I know we're working on D'Iberville and Biloxi right now. We're adding those. Um, I was thinking about Long Beach. I'm not sure if that's too far. 
Um, like I said, we kind of went all the way to the east, so we need to go all the way to the west now. Oh yeah, you like the blue one? Yeah, thank you. Um, we also, we have the blue one and we have the white one. I wasn't take those off to show y'all because I know a lot of y'all are local OS peeps. And I was gonna get your feedback to see which ones y'all like. So we've got the blue one with the logo. Can you see it? That's our large one. And we've got the white one with the logo. Let me know which one y'all like better. You like white or blue? Oh yeah, St. Martin. I'm glad, yeah, I have some um, St. Martin bows too. Is there any on here? I've got, oh yeah, right here. Here's St. Martin right there. So we've got that. Let me know like with the local schools, which colors that you want. I kind of try to play around with the base colors. St. Martin, it seems like a lot of people want yellow. Um, Ocean Springs, white and blue. Some people want gray. So let me know which ones y'all want. But those are a, oh, you know, I was going to bring something to kind of show y'all the size difference, but I don't have it. Maybe I should get a model out here, get my daughter. She's in the back <laughs> hanging out right now. But those are our large size bows. Here, I'll put them on me. They're about six inches wide. Um, and they are made with our uh, two and a quarter inch ribbon. So they're nice and thick and they're pretty big. They hold their shape really well. Because of the, the size they are, they do the embroidery. Uh, you can see the embroidery really well. Oh yeah, Football Fridays, definitely. I think, think that would be great. Um, uh, Kaylin says that's a size her daughter wears. Okay, that's great to know. Um, and so we have uh, th that size right there. So we're, I'm also working on adding, and let me just show you one of our little, get you one from over here. This is our medium size bow. And I don't have one in the school ones. Oh, I do have, I have an Ocean Springs one to show you. Come on. Here it is. So this is our medium Ocean Springs bow. So it's a little smaller, a little denser for the embroidery. It's about five inches wide. So here, let's see if we can compare them. So this is the large, this is the medium. Here's a medium on my head. Try to get it kind of far away so you can see. Here's a large on my head. Get far away so you can see. Oh yeah. That, that's one thing. Thanks. Thanks. I don't know if y'all know that, but we actually um, embroider everything back here in the shop back here. We have embroidery machines and we did decide to go with the um, embroidery because it just holds up so much better than the vinyl. It's not going to peel off when it gets too hot outside and it just holds up really well. Um, yeah, Kayla, we do. Yeah, we do them here in shop. We make everything in the back. There's actually some uh, gals in the back right now. They're working, they're embroidering, they're making the bows. We do it all here. We're completely made in the USA. So for sure, yeah, we do do that. And we embroider everything in shop. Um, I'm trying to figure out the tech on this thing, y'all. <laughs> y'all are asking me lots of questions. I love it. Um, let me see. Is your, let's see, is, is hers? Yeah, there we go. I think I did it. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Oh, um, yeah. Yeah. Jillian says she likes the big ones, but her daughter likes the smaller ones. I'm kind of finding that a little bit. Um, so we're trying to get more of our local ones in the smaller size. So it's a little harder to get the embroidery to stitch out well in the smaller size, but Hey, that's what we do. I mean, that's our specialty. We work on a ribbon, uh, Oh, yes. Thank you. Because I was fixing it to tell you all that because that is something that kind of tricks people up. Kaylin um, is our clips. And when we they get on the website or when they in the shop, it's easier because I can show them. But they get on the website and they're like, what? what's the difference between these clips? Um, alligator clip right and left um, confuses them. But this is our alligator clip right here. This is our one with T. And I really recommend if you want an alligator clip, um, you've got a girl with um, a lot of hair, which usually by school time you do. You want to get an alligator clip with teeth on it. Um, and we also have a French barrette. It's right here. These ones um, have this thing that open and close on it. They stamp closed. 
And if you'll see, if you can see these on here, we only get premium clips. They've got this reinforced metal right here. Cause I know with me, with my daughter, I was always having problems with those French barrettes falling apart. So I think that's one reason why a lot of people go for alligator clips. Um, but we do offer a premium clip in the French barrette. So along those lines, before I show you our last one, which is our ponyo elastic, um, we guarantee everything for life. So if you ever have a problem with a clip falling apart, um, we, we guarantee it for life. All you have to do is bring it back or send it back and we'll fix it and send it right back out to y'all. Um, yeah. Yeah. Kaylin says that the uh, alligators with teeth seem to work best. Yeah. And Jillian says she likes the ribbons. Oh yeah. I was going to show those here real quick too. Let me do that right now. So here is a, um, where am I at? Who am I showing right now? <laughs> <So cute. laughs> Sorry, y'all. Um, so here's our pony O's. That's our last option. We also have alligator clips without teeth. These are aligned alligator clips, but I don't really recommend those for school bows. Um, I usually re recommend it for uh, babies with very little hair. Um, so this is our ponytail elastic. It's made from nylon. As you can see, there's no metal. It's not going to snap on you. So we get these because we don't want our customers to have problems with our hair products. We take a lot of time making them. So we want to, to make sure that they're going to stay together for y'all. Um, so we use really good products. If you have problems with it, like I said, bring it back. We'll fix it for you. And here, I don't think I have an Ocean Springs ones ready to go. The one that Jillian's daughter was talking about. But these are the ones that hang off the, the ponytails. A lot of girls really like these. We always include some kind of glitter on them. They're really fun. I think for game days, for spirit days, and just, just any day. So, um, so I think that is most everything. Let me know if there was a school that you didn't see that you want. Um, we're adding, um, Biloxi and D'Iberville. I think we're going to, um, enter, uh, going to be doing Long Beach, um, Gulfport, so, and then we've got all the other ones from Moss Point to Van Cleve to East Central to Pascagoula. So we have all of those. Um, let me see. Oh, really, Kaylin? That's totally awesome. I love to hear that. That means so much. It also means that you take really good care of your bows too. So that speaks a lot for you too. <laughs> and your daughter does actually, because bows get a lot of wear and tear. <laughs> um, so, Oh yeah. She likes the, these ones with the sparkly and the ribbons on them. Yeah. Oh, there was one other one I was going to show y'all before I let you off. We're getting ready to get off of here talking about that. We also have these in the schools that these are really fun to tie in their hair. These are good for cheer camps or anything like that, or just to tie in the ponytail. They're nice. And they've got the little embroidered logo on, on there. And we're, uh, we've got those in, in most of the local schools, too. And then this one is fun. And um, this is our cheer style bow. So if you've got cheerleaders and they want the cheer, the big perky kind that can either wear up here at the front or somewhere in the back, we've got these. And you can even add their name to the bottom right here. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Jillian says that would work good under a softball helmet too. Yes, perf yes, that's right. It's not going to get smashed. <laughs> and then these kind too, they lay kind of flat. Um, so they they usually work good under the softball helmet too, and they'll bounce back up too, I think. So yeah, those are great for that. Okay, let me see if there was anything else I was going to, oh. Um, Okay, so the last thing I'm going to tell y'all before we go, unless y'all have any questions, remember to put in the comments if there's any local schools that you're not seeing that you want. Just remember to put that in the comments, and I will see about getting those added for sure. But before I let you go, I just want to let you know, for this weekend only, we're going to be having a 20% off sale for school bows. So it'll be any kind of, uh, any kind of bows you wear for schools. School, uh, solid bows, logo bows, even our uniform plaid, um, scrunchies, things like that. They're all going to be um, 
uh, 20% off. So you will just at the checkout use local 20. It's a flash sale. It ends Sunday night at midnight. So um, y'all just remember to use that discount code local 20 at checkout. Uh, and let me see real quick. Kaylin says, do you have uh, the plats? Yeah. Um, and you can also uh, send me a picture. You can message me like on, um, you can look on our uniform plaid and see if you can find it. But you can also message me a picture of it and I can let you know if it's one we have. Because I really don't know what St. Martin's plaid looks like. So I'd be interested in seeing it. So you could just send me a, um, a message on the Facebook page and I'll get it on there. So. All right. Well, great. Well, thank you all. I'm so glad you're here. Next week, we are going to be going a little deeper into our uniform plaids um, and we're going to be having some new school designs that will be coming out. But right now we've got our local school bows and this is going to be our only sale of the season. It's a flash sale. It's 20 percent off. Use code local 20 at checkout. All right. OK, talk to you all later. It was so great seeing you today. Thank you all.